Hi everyone, welcome to Gallery de Molencas. Start the montage. <laughs> it's actually, it's actually, believe it or not, the home of Perry Bear, Perry Bear Sugar Mill, or Mount Oreb. We're not sure, and you guys are looking straight into the sun. But it's going to be awesome. And now it's a gallery. And now it's a gallery. Basically, like structurally, this makes the roof very light. Right. So it can hold. It's all clay pots that were obviously made on the May side. Wow. Yes. Okay, well, this is Diane, and she's actually the, the artist. artist. This is her gallery, and her studio is back there, off limits. <laughs> and uh, she can basically tell you everything you need to know about this place. I'm not sure what we're doing here. Yeah. <laughs> Wow, so Diane actually takes her photography and puts it on a canvas so you could buy it off her website and get it shipped to you anywhere in the world and then you can frame it yourself. Aren't these amazing? Let's go check out some more. This place is absolutely unbelievable. I, mean, I cannot even imagine. And obviously just walking in here and seeing a pool in the middle of this beautiful gallery. I, wow, but then everything around it is even more beautiful. There's a chest there, there's an old gramophone. Wow. With an actual record on it. We could probably start it up and it would play. I'm not actually sure about that. And the house was built in when? 18... 1820. 1820. From 1820. Wow. Oh, and you've got a puppy. <laughs> Wait, we've got to go see the puppy distracted. And then through here, even more, even more. Actual design feature to make the roof light because the wood would keep burning if you made it out of some of the, it looks like lime mortar, it definitely looks like lime mortar with the clay pots that were actually made here and we'll probably be able to find the kiln outside. But wow, what a fantastic place and the brickwork is actually original. You don't want to be on a video. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hello, are you shy? Are you shy? Oh, you're not allowed inside. That's what it is. You're going to bark at me. Hi. Hello. Hello, puppies. Okay, now I won't tempt you any further. You'll get into trouble. No, I was playing with puppies. <laughs> Getting some now. And that's a copper pot under a picture of a hermit crab. I mean, wherever you look, there is something old and beautiful contrasting the art and ever present is the ceiling. That ceiling is amazing. Wow. And did you see we got a uh, chiselle? Is there a chiselle? You didn't immediately notice the chiselles. I didn't. Picture this being your lounge. I mean, with the beautiful cushions and the painting. But Ricky said there's a de chiselle, and you know how I love my de chiselles. Oh, there are two of them. Three. There are three. <laughs> Actual, well, Ricky's getting B-roll of that, so I'll put that over this bit here where I'm talking. Our good friend Malcolm. The place is incredible. Wherever you look, Ricky's just going to have a field day with, with, with pictures and video and film and... But... Now I'm getting carried away with oh, the artwork, croquet. which is what this place is for. A croquet! <laughs> That's so cool. <laughs> you don't even notice it. But I can't imagine what the building was actually used for. Maybe it's just because this is the simplest way to make a big span. Yes, yes, it's an arc. So it's a big span that's made really light with the pots in it, just to make a really big room. This beautiful bench leads on to a foosball table <laughs> and more art. The metal pot. For those who know, that's the original dishes up. But watch this. The represent reproduction. reproduction. This is a reproduction mm -hmm. of the dishes out. So if you can't pony up for the real one, <laughs> you can get, you can get one of these. <laughs> oh wow! Is it a print or did you actually paint it? No, no, no print. I'm sure. Yeah. Yeah. But it looks so real. Yes. Have a look, guys. You can actually see the paint on it. <laughs> so oh, yeah, that's cool. Wow. And this oh, yes. pink flower. That's is a this? Okay, did you take the photo? Or... Yeah. Okay, wow. Yeah, all the photos I take. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. Look how oh, beautifully it goes with the... 
I've already done that bit. Far. Oh, sorry. Of course, if you live in Mauritius, you're going to be able to get some beautiful, beautiful seascapes. Is that Round Island? That's Round Island. Mm-hmm. And, and there's yeah. Queen de Mere. Yeah. So that's exactly. actually here. This is actually here. It's <laughs> from the East Coast, yeah. This is the pool. Now, I would never would have seen this myself personally because you guys know how I see things, but look at the reflection in the pool. It's an actual tree outside. So you've got your tree outside through the bars, but we... And this is the whole pool, which is a renovation by a Mr. White in the 80s. Man. And a famous, actually a famous Sri Lankan architect. A famous... Yeah, Jeffrey Bauer. Jeffrey Bauer. Okay, so it was designed by a famous Sri Lankan, Jeffrey Bauer, mm -hmm. and it was paid for by Mr. White. The pool is brilliant with the, the reflection of the ceiling as well. You get that whole circle. So nice. Man, it's just wherever you look, there's something beautiful. Oh, and a Ricky as well. <laughs> Walking along the pond for the montage. <laughs> Wow, this place is just spectacular, everyone. It is unbelievable. You have to come visit and check out Diane's work. It is fantastic. Oh, and a wooden table. Look at this. It looks like it's a half upside down, right way around. Beautiful wooden table. I was about to walk out, but I'd forgotten to buy something, and now security has arrived. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, guys. They're not actually letting me out. I must, I'm just going to go back in and get something. Maybe that just your Yes. <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> Look at the floor. Thank you. Oh, yes. You've entered yes. external domain now. Do I smoke funny? No, I don't. I finally smoke it again. <laughs> this is the outside of the building. As you can see, it's slightly rounded. So it's got a very steep curve on the inside, but only quite shallow on the outside. Now there's something over there that Ricky's already discovered <laughs> that I just have to go and have a look at. Just a quick, a quick peek, sneak peek. Ricky and the puppies. <laughs> wow. It's a train carriage. Good morning. This is actually a train car. An actual train car from the 1800s. And so beautifully restored. If I'd known this was here, I would have come so much more earlier. So much more earlier. Wow, Brian. Anyway, I think it has been restored. It's probably, it's probably something. Wow, I'm, I'm just going to show you through the window. Yeah, you guys have like never seen anything like this before. What are these people doing? Okay, we can't see too much because it's a little bit reflective, but there is stuff in there. It's a bed. There's a bed. Wow, awesome. Well, the puppies like us. If you're enjoying this video, give us a thumbs up. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Like that. No. Okay. no, apparently they don't like us, so scratch that. This is actually a room. It's got a bed in it. But I think it's actually a place you can come stay. Oh, okay, they probably repurposed it as like a little guest room. Yes, that like old so train cool. guest room. Oh, wow, I still want to come stay here. Yeah. Maybe Diane can put it on Airbnb. That would yes, be if she put it on cool. Airbnb, I would be her first customer. Wow, and it's got the, the foot plates on the train. <laughs> you can actually sleep in it. How awesome is that? Red letter day. Red letter day. And it's been so beautifully restored. So, well done those guys. Over to Ricky where she asks you for a thumbs up. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> hey everyone, welcome to Playing with Puppy Not the Yard. Start the montage. <laughs> Come on guys, this is your cue. Start the montage, guys. Grab a stick. Uh, no, you're just interested in Brian. I wonder what this mysterious wall is in the middle here. Let's have a quick squiz. Oh wow, it's actually a well. It is actually a well and you can see quite deep into it. There we are, into the well. And there's just so much stuff around here. Possibly Mount Oreb or actually Peri Bear Mill, I'm not sure. Peri Bear Mill. I can only see a Mount Oreb marked on the map and not much else information about it at all. But wow, it is so beautiful. And look at the ramparts. And such a cool tree, this must be a 
one of those fruit things. Huh? Uh, did you step on another bogan villa? That one went right through my shoe into my foot. That's why we didn't get the ramparts. <laughs> Look at the size of these ramparts to hold up the building. Because it's a dome structure, you actually have to have quite a big rampart to hold it up. Man, this thing is massive. Ah, I don't know if you can see me just reaching to the end. Ah, that must be at least 75 centimeters thick. Cool. This must be part of the old building. This is definitely an old original bit. It hasn't been repaired, so you can actually see the stonework. And then you put the mortar over it, the, the lime mortar, right next to the, the well cut stones. But it's all just perfectly preserved. Doug's gonna go kick, check out your stone wall now. <laughs> A stone block. And there's a chimney. No, I didn't think there was a chimney. Check it out. It's a, it's a working one. Oi, oi, no, I'm supposed to get it. It's my trick. Okay, this is B-roll. Cut my lyrics. Cut my lyrics. Remember I said red letter day? I was wrong. Now it's a red letter day. Look at this. It's the lion head and he's working. The actual lion head and he's working. Can you believe how many we've seen that were like dilapidated and broken? An actual working one. Oh, oh man. Wow. I'm going to show you more close ups of that. That is so fantastic. Oh man. The lion is actually taking out the water. And you can just make out the little bit at the bottom there that we always wondered what it said. Still going to be wondering though. With his crown on, in glory. Oh, and I've got my camera in the way, so it makes it worse. <laughs> and yes, he is into a pond, which is actually quite beautiful in its own right, I suppose. But yeah, Ricky will get B-roll of that, because look at that. Oh, wow. So nobody gets to see this, but there may or may not be a chimney as well. <laughs> but it's not part of the tour. Not part of the tour. <laughs> well, everyone. There's Perry Bear, there she is, All standing tall, or Mount Oreb, we're not quite Perry sure. Bear's Mr. Perry Bear's chimney. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so it must be the private house, just attached next door. That also looks incredibly old. Super amazing place. Give a call and come arrange to visit and buy some photos or repro reproductions. Look how cool that is. But I also have got your... Yeah, it's there, it's our yeah. email. Yeah. I'll, I'll also send you an email with... Through there, you're probably not going to make it out, which is good, because this is clandestine footage. Mm -hmm. Is the car that was owned by SAJ, the previous Prime Minister of Mauritius. Yeah. You know, with old places like this, you just have no idea what you might stumble upon. And you're like walking along and it's like, okay, but what... What is it? What was it? But it's so super cool. It's intriguing. There's something around every corner. How awesome is that? <laughs> no man, I'm too, too far away. <laughs> oh man. I actually didn't notice this on my way in. But have a look at the cut on the sides here. They actually had an angle, which means that once the door was closed, you couldn't get out. Oh, wait a second, that's the wrong way around. Surely it shouldn't be get in. Anyway, so fortifications, really thick walls. There's more through that little door, but I'm not gonna show you, you're gonna have to come see it for yourselves. They've got place for a bonfire and place for a tea garden. And of course, lovely old banyan tree. Being careful not to eat the place. Awesome. Behind Tammy, is a wooden wagon. I'm not even going to show you. You're going to have to come and see it yourself. <laughs> it's probably older than Tammy. I don't know. I don't know if anything's older than Tammy. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lovely wagon. Well, everyone, I'd just like to thank Diane for having us here in her beautiful place. Remember, you have to come visit. You have to come visit. I haven't shown you <laughs> half the stuff. I'll just take an appointment.
Yes, but please make an appointment. We'll put the numbers and everything down below. You can check it out there and I have all the details for you, including her website. Thank you. Thank you. Anyway, everyone, I can think of no fitting place to do an outro than the Lionhead Fountain. How awesome. But how awesome is this place? It is fantastic. What they've done here, you can do with any sugar mill. Mm -hmm. Go ahead and do it. It's great. Well, anyway, everyone, thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Thank <laughs> you.